so if we had x squared um, plus 7x plus 12 greater than or equal to 0. So the last video was linear inequalities. Now we're going on to quadratic inequalities. And the way that I'm going to look at this is I'm going to try and sketch it. So what would this look like if I tried to sketch it? It would be a U-shape. So I need some knowledge of functions here. So it would be a U-shape. Um, but where would it, the U-shape go? You know, would it be very far over here? Would it be kind of over here? Would it be off over this way? The only way I'm going to be able to answer that is if I find the roots of, you know, this, if I graphed it or sketched, you know, as a function. So how do I find the roots? Um, there's loads of ways to do this. You could do this by the minus B formula. You could do it by, um, you know, creating your little square. Uh, and working that out, I just try and go factors of 12 that add to give me 7, 3x, 4x. x plus 3 is one factor, x plus 4 is the other. I'll add each factor equal to 0, and I end up at x is minus 3. So one of the roots is minus 3, and the other root is minus 4. Which means that minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4 probably looks something like that. A U-shaped graph. Um, minus 4 there and minus 3 there. And then where is my graph greater than 0? Well, all that means is where is it above 0? Well, there it is above zero. So how do I mathematically describe that? Well, can you picture, you know, somebody walking along the x-axis? And you're trying to picture, do they need to look up to see the graph? Or do they need to look down to see the graph? So I'm interested in when the graph is above zero. So I'm interested in when they have to look up. So this graph goes on forever, either direction. So, you know, if, if the person is standing in here, they need to look down. I'm not interested in that. So I'm interested in when they're standing, you know, at minus two, minus one, zero, because when they're standing at these locations here, they'll have to look up to see the graph. So when X is greater than minus three, they'll be looking up to see the graph. Or back here, so if they keep walking, they'll be looking down here in the middle but they'll go back to looking up for the graph when they go past minus four. So x is less than minus four.